UA-120 was a family of American solid-fueled rocket stages, manufactured by the Chemical Systems Division of United Aircraft later United Technologies Corporation. Several variants existed, with a varying number of segments. Topic. Design All versions of UA-120 shared a common design, with the only significant differentiating factor being the length of the motor. It was a segmented design, with between five and seven motor segments possible. A solid propellant, polybutadiene acrylonitrile, was used as fuel. The stage had an external diameter of 120 inches. Attitude control in flight was provided by means of a hydraulic thrust vector control system, with an external nacelle containing hydraulic fluid attached to the side of each booster. Solid-fueled separation rockets, used to jettison the spent boosters, were affixed at the top and bottom of the stage. Thrust termination capability, necessary for manned rockets such as the Space Shuttle or Manned Orbiting Laboratory, was to be provided by two pyrotechnically triggered ports on the forward closure, which when opened would allow for the non-propulsive venting of exhaust gases. The forward end of the stage contained an aerodynamic nose cone, an igniter, separation rockets, and the forward attachment ring. The aft end contained additional separation rockets, the nozzle, and a heat shield. Topic. Variants The overall design of each variant was very similar, the main difference being the number of segments used. This is indicated by the number at the end of each designation. Topic. UA1205 UA-1205 was used as a strap-on booster on the Titan IIIC, Titan IIID, and Titan EE rockets, and was proposed for use on several derivatives of the Saturn rocket family. UA-1206 The UA-1206 was used as a strap-on booster on Titan 34D and commercial Titan 3. Topic UA-1207. UA-1207 was used on Titan IVA. It was proposed for several other variants of Titan III and IV, as well as derivatives of the Saturn rocket family and the Space Shuttle. 